Hello everyone, this video will show you a very useful program named Sifo Speed. You may know this program, you may not. Uh, this program uh, can... Basically, I will start with something uh, simple. If, for example, I search about my motherboard, I can see that... Uh, say, think about this. Intel GPE LAN with Sifo Speed Internet Accelerator Software. Is that software? Okay. Um, now you will ask me, I can't use uh, this uh, program if I haven't, if I, if it doesn't support it from my motherboard or if I have Intel, if I have, if I have Realtek uh, network card, network adapter basically. Uh, no, you can use it, okay. uh, but it's, <laughs> it's better if you support from your motherboard like 100% because you may have a better uh, results. Okay, um, now, this program is a uh, rack, but if you want to buy it, search Sifo Speed and the first link, uh, you can buy it, cost uh, 16 uh, euros basically, okay. Um, now, this is the site, if you write Sifo Speed, you will search it, okay, and you will download it, okay. Um, I will have this uh, in description. I have already downloaded for you. Okay, basically I will have it in my Google Drive. Anyways, um, let's download. Let's install the program. Okay. Not uncheck this. Not standard installation. You can choose. You can choose the directory that you want to install it. Okay. I want my SSD. Trust me guys, it's a very useful program and I will show you uh, later some results. I have I have them here. Okay. Um I will let you know when this it finished. Okay, the installation it finished. Now as you see I have also these two uh, icons. If I open them I can see some details about uh, some settings that provide the tool. The software and how to calibrate my network uh, a guide okay i will delete them I, I don't need them okay now let's type sifos here okay i will uh, create shortcut excellent now i will open it and when i open it this will create a new uh window theoretically now okay I need to do it here first of all you will press right click options check for news and check it program updates and check it okay now basically i will show you later the settings and now i will this is my preference i will uncheck also these things okay and we are ready now and connection as you see we have a small window with that way we can uh, see uh, what is happening now uh, on network okay um, as you see we have this edge web view uh, usually I I am, I am installing this tool because I don't want it okay so I will remove it now I will reopen Zipo speed okay and when I open this <laughs> that now will create a new tab on my main browser okay i will start with some simple settings that i can uh, modify the first thing is to select favor ping time as you see if i enable this will minimize ping times and expands of slightly re reduced bandwidth okay this is really important especially if you have high ping Refresh DNS named. Okay, uh, you can enable it. I will keep it on. Packet loss avoidness. Of course, I will keep it on. And I remove use UPnP router statistics. We don't use. We don't need this. Also, enable automatic M MTU optimization. Okay, and uh, yeah. Of course, you can uh, do some uh, experiments with the settings. Okay, 
I'm not gonna do it now, but it's up to you to do anything you want. Now I have something also interesting to show you. If we go in programs games, we can find any game that we're playing and to set it high priority. For example, if you want to set to high priority Fortnite, we'll search the game as you see we are here and you will set all these things to higher. Uh, Fortnite launcher, I don't recommend you to set this to higher, keep it low, okay, but set the others higher. Of course, if you have any issue, just set it back in default settings, okay. And basically, that are the, the main uh, settings that we can uh, do uh, from, uh, from this interface, okay. Also, we can Disable traffic shaping or enable it by default is on. You can read info about what it's doing. Okay. I recommend you to keep this off. Uh, to keep this on. I'm sorry guys. Um, also, if you go in uh, network and sharing center. Change adapter settings, properties. As you see we have a new heading. C for speed for faster internet connection. NTIS 6. Don't uncheck this uh, option okay and now you have uh, this uh, tool uh, and this not gonna expired okay don't worry it's working properly of course if you want to use crack edition you can just buy it okay but i don't recommend you to give 16 uh, euros anyways now let's see some uh, tests that i did Okay, uh, we'll start uh, with uh, a game test that I did first is the Fortnite I did only in Fortnite because it was basically waste time to do for all games that I play um, As you see I have a small improvement basically it's not too small We have an improvement with Cepho Speed As you see the average ping without Cepho Speed is 56 with Cepho Speed is 49 the lower ping, the lower number that I reach was 53 with without Cepho Speed, with Cepho Speed was 47. And the highest ping that I reached was 58 with without Cepho Speed, I'm sorry. And uh, with Cepho Speed I had 51 uh, ping. So I, in my case I had a very good improvement with safer speed so uh, <laughs> I will use it of course um, let's go on the next test Oakla speed test okay as you see we haven't any difference as I said on the start of this video don't expect improvement uh, with uh, the speed test your speed is it is what it is you will see improvement on the management with this tool that it's doing uh, in Windows okay but let's see this without c speed i had these results with uh, c speed i had these results i verified these uh, results because i wanted to be sure about uh, the, this uh, result that uh, i show you now and i did three tests for every situation and i had basically the same results okay the same differences so my opinion is for sure use this program but if you want if you not see any improvement of course uninstall it okay but you can give a try for for this program it's it's free basically and may you see an improvement so why not um as you see guys it's really impressed for the first time i did this grade with uh, this tool a buffer bloat uh, oh, uh, at the most times I, I took this uh, grade C so it wasn't very nice but guys uh, it's really nice it's really nice in every situation I had some improvement so this program is worth but of course it's not for everyone some of you may see improvements some of you not so it's up to you to do your test to try it and just let me know in comments if you will see if you saw any uh, improvement. That was the video, guys.